starting with a shocking discovery in Collinsville. Deputies are calling the conditions deplorable. Two News Oklahoma's Jeanette Casada was first on the scene and is live tonight with details on the more than 100 incoming animal cruelty charges. Jeanette. Well, the sheriff's office has arrested the homeowner after receiving a tip about animal cruelty. We were there earlier today and we could smell some of those dead animals. And we do want to warn you, some of the details and images are graphic. Samuel Anthony Smith is in jail tonight after sheriff deputies found hundreds of animals in his home in awful condition. We received a tip uh, that the animals uh, here at this home on the outskirts of Collinsville uh, were not receiving the care that, that they needed and that they were in uh, deplorable conditions. When deputies went to check out his property, they noticed many chickens, some sharing cages with other dead chickens. Along with chickens, they saw a donkey, goats and other animals, many of them without access to food or water. And deputies could even hear some inside the home. So they immediately got a search warrant and returned to the home. We really dug in and saw what was going on in this home. We were pretty shocked by what we found on the inside. They found a total of 160 animals, among them chickens, goats, a pigeon, a donkey, and two incubators full of eggs in unlivable conditions. 15 of those animals were dead. We were extremely surprised by the sheer number, especially of the chickens. It seemed like every time we would open up one more, uh, one more enclosure, uh, there were just more and more of them. Deputies say some appear to have died recently, but others may have been decomposing for an extended period of time. They say the animals found alive were starving. They were very hungry. They're very thirsty. Uh, these animals did not receive uh, the food water and care that they needed. Smith is expected to be charged with one count of animal cruelty for each animal on his property found dead and alive. So upwards of 160 charges total. Roebuck says some animals inside were found in a room with the floor covered in feces. These are not conditions in which uh, any animal or human should live. So based on that, the animals have been taken by the Humane Society. Uh, they will be kept uh, as evidence in this investigation. Now, the sheriff's office is asking the public to report any animal cruelty case as a reminder through this case. Also tonight, we've learned that Samuel is being held on a $320,000 bond. That is $2,000 bond for each of the 160 charges. Live in Tulsa, Janet Quesada, 2 News, Oklahoma.